Hi there, Dan Andritzi with Remax bringing you the market update for Santa Clarita Valley, April 2012. Uh, we're going to be looking at some quick numbers here, comparing them to April 2011, and more importantly, we're going to be comparing uh, quarter one of this year to the first quarter of last year, 2011, and see if we can uh, pick out some trends and figure out where the real estate market is headed. Uh, we're looking at uh, total residential listings uh, in the Santa Cruz Valley in uh, April of 2011. We were up to uh, 1,191 properties for sale. We currently have 668 properties for sale in April 2012, representing a decrease of about 44% in the number of homes for sale. Uh, next, average list price. We have seen a jump of about 11.5% year to year from April last year to April uh, this year. Uh, 412 to 465 is our uh, average list price number there, $465,000 this, this year. Uh, our average market time has decreased from 133 days down to 79 days. So we're looking at a, a reduction in the uh, t amount of time it takes to sell a home of about 40%. And our absorption rate uh, in the Santa Cruz Valley is down from 4.8 months in April 2011 to 2.4 months in April 2012. Uh, once again representing a, a lean towards the sell a seller's market. Uh, when we look at year-to-date numbers uh, for 2012 and compare them to 2011, we see that uh, we've had a significantly higher number of homes sold this year. Uh, 1,263 to be exact as compared to 1,102 in the first quarter of last year. So uh, approximately uh, what is that, about 12% increase in the number of homes sold. Uh, average list price has increased. Average sales price has for the most part held steady. Uh, we saw a little bit of a bump in January from 346 in 2011 to 360 this year. And uh, I'm sorry, this is the median price, not the average price, by the way. Uh, in February, we looked at a slight decrease from 385 in 2011 to 358 in 2012. Uh, another small increase in March, 376 to $378,100 in March 2012. And April has been as held, held even, 375 in 2011. 375 now. So if you look at all these statistics, take them all into account. Uh, our total number of homes available has decreased. The average list price has increased. The median sales price has remained steady. And the total month's inventory or the absorption rate has been cut in half. So uh, it doesn't take a whole lot of speculation to look at those numbers and say if this continues, uh, we definitely have hit bottom or are very close. Uh, to seeing uh, some some turnaround in the marketplace. Not saying that we're going to again see double digit appreciation like we did in 2004 and 5, but we are already seeing multiple offers on properties, properties selling out in one and two days, and uh, this is good. This is what we need. So let's hope that trend continues. And ad, as always, if I can help you with any of your real estate needs, please uh, feel free to find me at danielsellsscv.com and findvalenciahomes.com. Uh, thanks for listening, and I look forward to talking to you soon. Bye.